Dear students, now we shall read chapter number 2, The Little Prince. This chapter is all about adventure and imagination. These two are its theme. This chapter is an excerpt from The Little Prince novel written by Antony de Saint Exupery. He was a French writer, poet, journalist and pilot. Dear students, excerpt means a part, a small part taken from a big novel. I'll read the chapter over here and you will read with me at your own place. So let's begin with warm up. Work in pairs, tell each other two things that you like about being a child and two things you don't like. Then ask each other what is good and what is not good about being a grown-up. Grown-up means when you grow up and you are no longer a child. It means you have to tell what is a good thing about being a child. Which thing you enjoy the most being a child and which thing you don't like being a child. Now let's read the chapter. Read this excerpt from the book The Little Prince by Antony D. St. Exupery. It introduces us to the narrator, a pilot whose plane crashes in a desert. Find out what happens when he unexpectedly meets a strange person who makes an odd request to him. In this chapter, the narrator he got his plane crashed and he landed in the middle of Sahara Desert. Let's start reading. Once when I was six years old, I saw a magnificent picture in a book called True Stories from Nature about the primeval forest. It was a picture of a boa constrictor in the act of swallowing an animal. Here is a copy of the drawing. Students, now the writer is telling his story that when he was six years old, he saw a picture. Magnificent means very good picture in the book and book's name was True Stories from Nature. This book was all about primeval forests. Primeval means forests related to the period when earth first came into existence. It was a picture of a boa constrictor, means it was an animal that used to swallow, eat the whole animal in one go. And uh, for your better understanding, the writer has given one picture of it also. In short, the writer is telling about that in his childhood, he saw one picture in a book and that book was uh, about the primeval forests about early existence of the forest and the picture was all about a dragon sort of animal that used to eat its prey in one go in the book it said boa constrictors swallow their prey whole without chewing it after that they are not able to move and they sleep through the six months that they need for digestion. Boa constrictor, it's a type of large snake. Maybe just like an anaconda, as we have these snakes on earth right now also. And prey here means an animal that is food for other animals. So boa constrictors, they swallow their whole prey in one go. They don't chew it. They just swallow it. And because the prey is so big that they cannot move. So they keep on sleeping for months and it helps them in digesting their food.